Lifted him. That's going to be six. Cleared in right into the sand. Superb hit by Imran. Beautifully timed. To our right. Cleared the rope. Cleared the sand. And somewhere there. Third tier, I think. Third tier. Caused a certain disturbance there amongst the crowd. Well, our scorer says, row six, zero, is it? Zero. Well, he's got all the details of that six. Let's take a look at it again. A tremendous hit by Imran. In fact, it's not the replay of that hit. Well, we would have thought we might have seen that again. It was a beautiful hit by Imran. Hope this is the hit. Yes, there it is. That's the six. Been long on and mid wicket. Back to us. Thanks, our coach, silly point. He's batting with a little more freedom. Miss Field. He's going to get 200 of the Pakistan innings. The ball spun away from the fielder. So, Yadam. Yadav to continue. And uh, he went down the wicket trying to drive him, lift him, uh, got a bottom edge to that and uh, very nearly got run out. Some very, very fine feeling from Sirikan. Let's look at that replay. Just a close call for him. Brilliant bit of feeling by Terry Khan. Run saving field on the offside. Tough speed to him run. And this time he sweeps and sweeps well. Very fine. The ball running down the deep fine leg. And that'll be four. Long chase from Mohinder Ramanath from uh, Long Lake. Four runs to him run. 296. Imran now on 26. Goes back, drives that one superbly. Even Azruddin will give up the chase as the ball races to the fence, and that's a lovely shot. Very well timed and perfectly placed between the two fields when it extra cover and mid off for four. The best shot he's seen from the Jazz Pussy so far. Goes to 20 and takes Buck down on 217 for six. And run goes back. He plays that one and that's uh, very well fielded by Meninda. The ball wouldn't have gone for four in any case, but um, Ron picks up a single. And he keeps the strike as well. Last ball before lunch, top hill to Ajaz Fati. That one kept very, very low outside the off stump. Uh, no serious problems for Ajaz Fati. And that is lunch here on the second day of the fourth test match between Pakistan and India here at Ahmedabad. Who uh, was shining out. And then Imran and Ijaz Saki between the two of them really have lifted the quality of Pakistan's back. Quite substantially. that Sijan Saki just joined the team here in Ahmedabad. This is a wonderful inning from him. He adjusted himself very quickly to test cricket. He's played some very, very good shots in the been a fine inning from him. It should be four runs without any difficulty at all. Plenty of room for Sijan Saki that was 
coming onto the bat slowly. Plenty of time for him to adjust himself, leaning back and punching that to point. Four runs. Kalsaki came in after Imran and he's overtaken him. Short and Imran's going to get four runs. That's a beautiful shot from Imran. That was four all the way. Just a token attempt by Venkatesh to stop that. Imran on 49. Quite a race between Imran and Dijaz Saki. Keeping up with one another. LBW की अपील हुई लेकिन चुके यादेव राउंड दिल के बॉल कर रहे हैं बॉल बाहर जा रही थी कोई इम्कान नहीं था एक रन का इजाफा एक रन के साथ पाकिस्तान के 300 रन मुकम्मल छह विकेटों के नुकसान पर इमरान लेज बैक्स एंड क्रैक दैट वन ग्लोरियसली दैट विल बी फोर as it gives up the chase, the ball crosses the fence. And in fact, uh, Gopal Sharma gave him run too much room to play that one. Lean back, try to square the wicket for four. The crowd certainly has quietened down since the guards for key and Imran came together. And it must have been pretty close. Imran trying to sweep the ball from just about middle and off. They run a leg by, but uh, not a very good shot to play. It is for three counts who's coming into attack. There he is. So Kapil Day is now trying everything to buy a wicket. An optimistic appeal. In fact, he's showing the umpire where the ball fits. Umpire Gupta is really not interested. But a good try by Srikant. Runs it down to third man. They'll get at least two. They will get three. Then Ran races back for the third. 3.23 for 6. Runs it down to deep fine leg. Very faint tickle there. It might run for 4 and it will. And in fact, the umpire has given 4 leg bites. 329 for 6 now. Imran stays on 72. A hip between these two. 154 runs have been put on by them. Imran is gone on board. And this partnership broken. It's the end of a very fine inning. Gopal Sharma for 72. The seventh Pakistan wicket has fallen. Obviously, India very relieved to see the back of Imran. So, action fade away after tea. Abdul Kader now coming in Imran bowled by Gopal Sharma for 72 in Pakistan are 330 for seven Imran.
run out for 72 without adding to his score, the first wicket falling in the first over after T. And that's the replay of Imran's dismissal. Sharma to Imran. Imran goes forward. Beaten and bowled. So into this has come Abdul Qadir, but Imran has done his job. The quicker ball pushed through. Just that he's looking a little tentative. It's over. And uh, we'll wait for the umpire signal whether he's going to allow a run there. Came off the pad. By attack. Signals two by. Carter and fighting the wicket keeper there. So two more runs to Pakistan. They go on to 336. <coughs> this is of their own doing. Abdul Qadir no, Pakistan team so Bhavan. A core Shandar fielding Kamzaira or fielder Azuruti or Kono Sakai on Tilava. Yapta fielder hai, Bhoti, who surat and Dazra Bhatte hai, or AP action may. Pick up or throw. कर रहे हैं अब उल्फाज़ से और इस दफा ऊंचा जोरदार शॉट और देखना ये है अंपायर का इशारा छक्का बहुत खूबसूरत शॉट बॉल थोड़ी सी शॉट थी अब्दुल कादिर ने जगह बनाई पांव का इस्तेमाल किया बैकफुट पे आए और निहायत शानदार मिड विकेट पर शानदार छक्का ये देखिए एक्शन रिप्ले ठीक पोजीशन में आके जोरदार छक्का और एक और छक्का इजाज पक्की निहाय शानदार जैसे ही बॉल बैट को छुई ऐसी टाइमिंग थी कि यकीनी तौर पर ये कहा जा सकता था वाजे तौर पर के बॉल छक्के के लिए ग्राउंड से बाहर जा रहे हैं। नया शानदार टाइमिंग, बहुत खूबसूरत शॉट, बहुत उम्दा बैटिंग, जितनी भी तारीफ की जाए कम, पिचानवे, इस पिचानवे में सात चौके और तीन छक्के शामिल। Very quickly from the crowd, I hope he keeps his cool and doesn't play for the gallery. because he really has deserved this marvelous hundred. Three short of it. Kadir on 20. Bucky sweeps and there's another field and it's a, a very, very optimistic one because the ball pitched outside the line of the leg stump. Watch it again. 
cross batted spot there from Ajaz Fakhi. Abdul Kai there trying to cool him down. In comes Menenda, goes to Fakhi, who goes down to wicket, plays it in the air, it's safe, and it's a six. And what a magnificent way to get to his hundred. Well played, Ijaz Faki, and what a fine hundred. The crowd rising to its feet to cheer the man who's brought such a lot of stability to Pakistan batting and has gone on to a very, very fine hundred with a towering six. He goes to 104 in Pakistan to 379 for seven. The fan club invading the pitch. Ijaz Faki's maiden test century. And what a time to get it. Absolutely delighted Ijaz on the screen. He joined the team just before the end of our test match and adjusted fairly quickly. Well, I'm sure he is really thirsty at this moment, calling for a glass of water. In partnership. Must be a very tired man, had long goals. And that's the end of Melinda Dover. Polling figures uh, now read 56 over 21 maidens, one for 106, and the umpires are still standing their ground as the players walk off, signaling uh, the end of the day's play. Umpire Ramachandra Rao was certainly not very happy about it, but it is the end of the second day's play here at uh, Gujarat Stadium in Hyderabad. Is that Pakistan? have advanced to 379 for the loss of seven wickets. Ijaz Faki is unbeaten on 104. The highlight of uh, today's batting has been his 100, and of course, Imran's magnificent 72. Abdul Qadir is not out on 20. Uh, that's the full scorecard for Pakistan. Faki on 104. Started batting on 20. A marvelous display of batting by Pakistan, making amends for yesterday's poor performance. Tomorrow is the day of rest. And at the end of the second day's play, from all of us here at Ahmedabad, for the office and back to the studio.
بہت خطرناک تھی اور خوش قسمتی اجاز صفی کی انہوں نے کھیلنے کی کوشش کی لیکن خوش قسمتی ان کی جو بال بیٹ سے نہیں چھوئی ورنہ یقینی طور پر کرن مورے کیچ پکڑ لے خطرناک بال اور بہت خطرناک طریقے سے کھیلے اپنے القادر ہیں خوش قسمتی ایک بار پھر بال ان کے بیٹ سے نہیں چھوئی اور اجاز پسی جا رہا ہے ان کے پاس ان کو کچھ مشورہ دینے کے لیے کہ ان کو کس طرح سے کھیلنا چاہیے یہ دیکھتے ہیں ایکشن ری پلے یہ بال آف سم کے باہر سے زوردار اپیل لیکن بہت آگے کھیلے تھے اجاز فقی پاکستان تین سو اسی سات وقتوں کے نمسان سے صفحہ سریف کیا ہے قادر نے بہت بڑی تیزی سے آ رہی ہے اور لوگی شاستری روکنے میں کامیاب ہوئے پاؤں سے انہوں نے بال کو روکا آخری لمحے پر جبکہ وہ باؤنڈی لائن کے خریب کی بالکل اور اچھا سرو ربی شاستری کا دو رن کا اضافہ عبدالقادر تیز پاکستان تین سو بیاسی کا اشارہ ایک رنگ کا اضافہ پاکستان تین سو سراسی رنگ سات وکٹوں کے نقصان کا یہ ہے ایکشن ری پلے بہت آگے کھیلے تھے جاز صفی اور اپیل صرف بڑی مجھے کم کر دی ہے فیلڈر دو تین مرتبہ انہوں نے بال کو پکڑنے کی کوشش کی لیکن رن کا کوئی امکان نہیں تھا اس لیے کہ بہت قریب تھے وہ وکٹوں کے اور رن آؤٹ کا خطرہ تھا پاکستان کا سکور کارڈ اس انگز میں رمیز راجہ نے کھیل اس وقت رکا ہوا ہے رمیز راجہ نے کالیس رن بنائے سلیم یوسف نے دو رزوان الزمان پانچ یونس احمد چالیس سلیم ملک بیس منظور الہی جنہوں نے آ کر اس کھیل کا رخ بدلا اور یہ دکھایا کہ اس وقت پر بڑی آسانی کے ساتھ سٹروک پلے کا بھی مظاہرہ ہو سکتا ہے اور تیزی کے ساتھ رنز بھی بنائے جا سکتے ہیں بڑی اچھی ٹائمنگ کے ساتھ بہت خوبصورت انگز کے لیے باون رن بنائے اور پھر اس کے بعد ایک نہایت شاندار پارٹنرشپ عمران خان اور اجاز پسی میں ایک سو چپن رن کی یہ ہے تماشائیوں کا ایک اور منظر کھیل اس وقت رکا ہوا ہے پاکستان کی پہلی وکٹ دو رن پر دوسری تیتیس رن پر تیسری باسٹ رن پر چوتھی نمیانوے رن پر پانچویں ایک سو انہنچہ رن پر پیل پر 
LBW. Started playing forward. Bit optimistic. That four leg bias in fact. Here's a replay of that uh, team from BW. Started going forward. Not fully forward. Three eighty seven now for seven. Four leg buys. See the replay again. A bit optimistic to shout. Hey, taking chances there when uh, starting down the wicket. Safe, I think, in the knowledge that uh, Kieran Moore is standing back. And now, does that uh, call for admonishment from Carter? This is the replay. There you see, just have to going down the wicket. Nowhere near the ball, this is completely off people in the ground. Quicker delivery and he's uh, stumped is he? There's an appeal, but uh, negative by the umpire. Right down the next side, Chisnal Yadav is protesting to the umpire, but uh, he's given not out. Look at it again. Then Mori had to cover a lot of ground then. And I think Ijaz Fakir had just made his run. See from the other end. Just coming down the wicket and uh, quicker delivery down the leg side. So close call for Ajaz Fakhi. And this would have been Kiran Mori's third stumping in this inning. Just as well that the ball was uh, very wide of the next stump and that gave Ajaz Fakhi time to come back into his feet. But Shivla Yadav is not quite satisfied with the decision of the umpire, but uh, no damage done, 391 for seven. That's the end of a good over from Shivla Liade. Raises his hands and complains uh, to the heavens. He was quite sure that uh, that was a something and uh, the judge would have gone back to the pavilion. A couple days to progress.